Last year, my son Chris was coming to the Dreamer program to design to help students to improve their skills. In this program, Chris and I were playing goldfish with Dr. Steve. Just by playing this game a few times, I noticed it helps my son read. At the same time, I was failing to get my GED. So I asked the doctor if he can help me out with this uh, reading. So I started using the rocket phonics to help me out with my reading. And six months later, I got my GED. I'm going to college, getting ready to start. Letha's story illustrates the cycle of poverty that uh, plagues the inner cities. And uh, it starts with the achievement gap, the low-income kids reading uh, lower than the wealthier family. Then the students who don't read at grade level don't really understand their homework and gradually get tired of, of failing in school. And, of course, what happens is they're four times more likely to drop out and no diploma, no job. This multi-generational uh, problem affects two out of every three children and it's easy to cure. This is a, a, a game that helps your child to learn how to read better, to do better. Not only your child, it can help you as an adult. Um, this game is called a rocket phonics. It is a tool that someone uh, invented that can help our schools and bring the schools to a level that your child may read better. And you start this game out very easy. You start out dealing some cards. And when you deal the cards out, and you get a chance to see what it's all about. In 2001, UCLA released a study of rocket phonics. The most important finding was no one who did more than one lesson failed to improve. Our average gain was nearly one year and three months. Rocket Phonics closes the achievement gap within months. For nearly 20 years, we've been selling this product to parents who could read. But to bring it to families with parents who can't read takes volunteers who love kids and love to play with them.